Today's episode is about celebrities and private jets. This has been covered in the press recently about how some celebrities are using their jets for three, 10, 15 minute flights um, and how, you know, this is polluting the environment, blah, 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 blah. So we're going to get into sort of the meat of this discussion. And um, uh, uh, Newsweek reached out to me the other day to talk about this and uh, they interviewed me. So you can click on the link below to the uh, Newsweek article all about BizJet TV and myself and my take on the celebrities using private jets. Now, um, is it good? thing for a celebrity to use a private jet well forget the celebrity let's just look at the usage of private jets now some of these people of you know they talk about Kylie Jenner and her three minute flight from Van Nuys to Camarillo why did they do that well that was a positioning flight positioning flights happen all the time a positioning flight is when you have the airplane at one location and the passengers at another or you're taking the airplane from one location to another for some maintenance or whatever that's called a positioning flight and the airlines do it all the time Private jet companies do it all the time. It's perfectly normal. It's just part of the business. And you can't not do the positioning flights. So that that's that one out of the way. Now, um, some people were using the private jet to take people on joy rides for 15 minutes. Now, that is a bit of a waste. Uh, because, you know, you if you want to take someone for a ride on your airplane, you should be going somewhere or have them jump on your plane when you're going somewhere to do a deal. Now, Elon Musk was mentioned in, in the interview. Um, that I did and Elon Musk is very clever the way he uses private jets he couldn't do the business that he does if he didn't fly private now he's building lots of electric cars he's doing the whole SpaceX thing and these are two things which are going to impact humanity in a positive way and so this is the question you need to ask yourself if, wh why are these people using the jet is the usage of that particular business trip on that private jet going to benefit mankind overall so you're going to open a new, you know, you're creating a new product. You're going to open a warehouse. You're going to employ people. These people are going to make money. They're going to be able to maintain their families, send their children to school, help their kids develop their talents. These are all good things. OK, and this is really how the private jet needs to be used. I mean, there's other celebrities like, for example, Cristiano Ronaldo, the, the, the soccer player. Some people criticize him for flying around in a Gulfstream G200. But Cristiano, you know, couldn't do what he does. Uh, and perform the way he does at his age, 37 years old, he's still playing football at the, at the highest level possible. Um, and, you know, he uses the private jet to fly him in between matches and that to do some business, but also to go and spend some time on the beach to recharge his batteries so that then when he gets on the football field, he can perform. And, and, you know, and everybody's happy to see Cristiano score the goals that he scores. And, you know, he's also a businessman. And he's got a lot, lot of businesses where he employs people and that. Um, and he invests money into businesses and that. Um, and, you know, and he uses the private jet to go and do these deals. And, he, and for his people, his team members also to go out and do things. So as long as the private jet is being used for, for positive things and there's nothing bad about uh, somebody with a bit of money using the private jet to go on holiday, it's more comfortable. Maybe they can get to the place direct. They can recharge their batteries so that when they go back to doing business, they're more with it and ready to do a deal. And, and that deal creates jobs. Uh, that deal creates products that improves uh, people's lifestyle, improves, uh, you know, the life of humanity. Uh, we need these people. Uh, you know, we need to be able to put people in a position to do their best. And the private jet, as I always say, is a great peak performance tool. So, are some celebrities misusing private jets? Of course they are. Of course they are. Um, and I talk about this in, in my article. Some people do use private jets for the wrong reasons. But that doesn't make the private jet an evil thing. Uh, this is really, really important to understand. I mean, it's a bit like the whole gun thing. And, and you know, and I'm going to say this now. You know, the bad guys will always have guns. So, shouldn't the good guys have guns too? Should the good should should guns be regulated? Maybe to a certain point. I, I, more than regulated, I think that whoever has a gun should know how to use the gun so that they are safe. And if they are going to take out a criminal in a supermarket that's trying to shoot everybody, and you pull your gun out, that you know how to use it and you know how to hit the target. It's a bit like an airplane. If you've got an airplane, you need to get a pilot's license to fly it. But that's not enough. You need to be proficient. You need to know what you're doing. You need to continuously train yourself to be proficient and, 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 and to fly safely. It's really, really important. Can an airplane be used as a weapon? Well, it was on 9-11. They flew it into a building. Does that mean you should um, stop people from flying airplanes because they're dangerous? They kill people? Um, like the whole gun thing? Uh, well, it's the same thing with the private jet. It's how you use it. 
And that really, really is key. And don't start going now on me about gun control and this and that, because this video is not about that. I'm just giving some examples here to explain the fact that the private jet is a business tool. It's a peak performance tool if used in a certain way. So let's not do what some of these, you know, socialist journalists are doing where they're going on and they're bashing the private jet industry, talking about, oh, these jets, these rich guys fly around in, you know, they pollute the air and this and that and the other. No, 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 no. Let, ask the question, who's using the jet? Where are they going to? And what kind of deal are they going to do when they get there? And how is that deal going to benefit mankind? So that really, really is important. Because at the end of the day, we can connect through YouTube. We can do a Zoom call. But meeting face-to-face -face in person is ultimately the best way to have a meeting. Now, sometimes it's not always possible. And sometimes, you know, having a few Zoom meetings before meeting in person is, is a great idea. But ultimately, people need to meet with people face to face. And this is where the private jet allows uh, people to do that. And let's face it, it's a bit like, you know, traveling by bus. Where you walk out your house in the morning, you're going to walk 10 minutes down the road, stand at the bus stop, wait for the bus, get on the bus with 100 strangers. Um, maybe the bus is late. Get to the other end, get off the bus, walk another 15 minutes compared to having your own car, maybe with a chauffeur. Chauffeur drives you from your house to the exact location where you need to go. And that's the difference between having a private jet and flying commercial. So if you had someone driving you from A to B all the time and you didn't have to worry about parking when you got to the other end, if you're in places like New York or London, you know, these busy cities where it's difficult to find parking and that, you know, if you were to could be dropped off and, and not having to drive the car, so you could be working while you're in the car, so you're being more productive, you get to the other end, you get out, you go straight to your meeting. This is exactly what happens with the private jet. And if it's used that way, then it's a great business tool. It's a great benefit to mankind. So celebrities using private jets. Yes, they are. Some using it correctly, some incorrectly. So that's the, those are the questions. It's all about the questions. You know, where are they going? What are they doing when they get there? And is whatever they do going to benefit mankind? That's really, really the key. So if you haven't subscribed to Budget TV, I encourage you to subscribe to this channel. Also check out this other video. I'm sure you're going to enjoy it. Uh, you know, my interview I did recently <coughs> with uh, Charlie, um, the plumber, uh, how he built his successful business and sold it and how he flies private jet. Uh, Charlie Mullins, great interview. I'm sure you'll enjoy that. And uh, subscribe to BizJet TV, as I said. Love to hear your comments below. That's all from Fabrizio Papali on BizJet TV. And I'll see you in the next one.